as how to launch a profitable gym business and create lifelong passive income with a successful gym business. You guys are going to learn why this is one of the best business models out there, why it's the most automatable business, why it's one of the best businesses for your cash flow, and why it's one of the easiest to both launch and to manage. In addition, you're going to learn why this industry is one of the best ones to be in because of demographics. It's going to be growing for a very long time and it's going to be growing at a rapid rate. Right now, the market's about $30 billion in the US, about 70 to $80 billion worldwide. It's growing very rapidly as people are aging and people have health issues. They need services that you get at a gym. They need trainers. They need uh, to be consuming oftentimes supplements and other health products. And due to the fact that a gym uh, can be totally automated now, you know, automated check-in, automated payments. You really don't need to have um, any employees at all, except for one or two staff members to be on site for part of the day to handle signing up new members. And if you're going to have personal trainers there and things like that, you don't need very much uh, human labor. You don't need much overhead at all. And it lowers all of your costs and it makes everything very easy to manage. You don't need to be on site to run this type of a business once you get it set up and actually due to the nature of the software and the technology that is changing right now it's getting easier and easier it's a very very cash flow positive business because there's two ways that people pay for the service one of them is they have it automated so the monthly membership fee just comes out of their bank account so instead of having to have, do accounts receivable where you send out bills and things like that which is usually really bad for your cash flow because you're rendering a service and you're waiting for cash to come in it can give you really bad cash flow problems it's one of the biggest risk that you take as a small business owner. Well, in this case, the money just comes out automatically and so your cash flow is excellent. On the other hand, the second way that you have money coming in is when you give discounts for longer term memberships. For example, if they pay cash for a whole entire year and they can save 10 or 20% or more, which we're gonna talk about uh, in the course, then what happens is you get a huge influx of cash for a long term service. You're not rendering the service yet but you're getting the cash to come in. So it's really, really good for your cash flow and you offer a lot of value when you give those discounts for people to commit themselves for a long time and they may or may not even use the membership. I and mean, one of the famous things about customers of gyms is they sign up for New Year's resolution and, or they're really motivated in the short term and they stop coming. Now we don't necessarily want them to stop coming. But the thing is once they pay their money, we have it and um, whether they come to the gym or not, that's none of our business. So it's really, really good for the cash flow. I'm going to teach you guys some ways that you can make the cash flow even better and you can really juice up your short term results so you've got money that's flowing through the business uh, from the very, very beginning. So it's one of the very few business models that can be made totally passive. It is um, one of the business models where there are there many ways to launch. There's many different kinds of niches and markets. And so even though there may be a lot of competition in your hometown or in your city, there's almost always a way to have a profitable gym business. You can have a small gym that can be very, very profitable without costing a lot of money to launch. So you can start with little or no money in many cases, which is not the case for a lot of other businesses. And also you don't need to be an expert to run a gym. I mean, you need some machines, you need some weights, you need to have the systems in place, a check-in system, um, which pretty much comes as a package deal with the software you're going to pay for and um, everything is running for you it's like a little money machine you don't even have any business experience really to do this although you will learn as you go there will be lots of things you'll need to learn as you do it but um, in this course i'm going to give you guys materials from my actual gym that i launched and sold off over here in vietnam i'm going to give you guys business plan financial analysis that we use the forecasts and uh, even the logos and stuff 3d renderings the design of our gym everything that you guys would need to launch your own gym. And even though you guys may want to launch one that's a smaller scale than the one that we did, I'm gonna give you guys a lot of ideas and I'll give you a really good example of what you can do. So again, you don't need to have a lot of business experience to launch a gym. Um, it's one of the fastest growing industries and it will continue to be one of the fastest growing industries out there for a very long time. That's something that you really wanna have if you're gonna be opening a gym business. It's projected to continue growing for a long time and the automated monthly payments or large chunks of cash up front for the discounts for the long-term memberships um, all lead to it being a very low risk business compared to almost all the other businesses that are, that are out there and in addition to all this stuff um, there's a lot of really good franchises so that if you do have some capital to get started um, in a larger scale 
you can buy one of the franchise models um, that we're going to talk about in the course that can make it even easier and you can make a larger amount of money than you otherwise would. So there's lots of ways to succeed in this business. It's much easier than most different types of small businesses and you don't need to be a genius or a business expert to do it. So um, with that, we're going to jump right into it and I'm going to teach you guys how to launch a successful gym business. Thank you.